Hi, this is Randy Nordell, and welcome to episode eight of the SimNet Instructor videos. Um, in this episode, we're going to be looking at how to bulk edit SimNet assignments. So, so far, I've shown you how to set up your course, how to add contents in, in the uh, edit assign area. In the last episode, we looked at the organize area, and that's what this is right here, the or course organizer, and how to create groups and organize content within within those groups and then also how to edit assignment details in this area so in the organized area this is a good one when you're editing individual assignments and going in and changing the dates or any of the other assignment details um, but we also have a feature to bulk edit so one of the best practices of when you're creating your course is to deselect the enable schedule by dates and then after your course is all ready to go then go back in and add in your start date due date and end date so i'm going to show you how to bulk edit and the way you do that is you go to the edit assign area so i'm going to go my courses here and choose edit assign on this course you can also go to all courses and go to the actions menu on the far right and choose edit assign but if your course is starred this is an easy way to get there and I'm going to do projects for now so I'm going to click on projects and the way that you bulk edit is selecting, you could select all, you could select, you could hold down the control key and select non-adjacent ones. You could select the first one, scroll down to the bottom, hold down the shift key and select all of them. The shift key selects a range. And up in the upper right hand corner is the edit selected button. So I'm gonna click that and up will come this, and this will edit all of the selected um, the assignments you have selected and you could edit different areas so I could edit the scheduling area the assignment preferences but I'm gonna go ahead and click on update and this will allow me to edit everything so um, enable schedule by date so I could put in a due date and kind of the best practice what I do is I tend to put in the start date I, I typically open the courses up three days or the Wednesday before courses start and um, put in that date and then I'll put in the end date the last day of the semester and what I'll do is put in the end date for the due date so you have to fill in all three of these uh, SimNet won't allow you to just leave one blank so you have to fill in all those but I'll put in the course end date here on all those then what I can do is just go back and later individually in the organize area enter the um, the exact due date for my syllabus and the end date to customize those. So I'll go ahead and put in the last day of the semester. Let's call that December 15th. And I'm going to just click the down arrow here to copy that down. And I could also update other areas. If I wanted to update the assignment preferences, the number of attempts and what displays, I could do that. If I wanted to update the gradebook options or the restrictions, I could do that as well. So the bulk edit, it's really easy, kind of hidden. Okay, so you do have to select everything and click that edit selected button over here at the right. But um, but it is a quick and easy way to edit um, the assignment details on multiple assignments at once rather than doing it individually at the end i'll save and it's all done if i go and edit look at any one of these now you'll see that those settings are there and that is bulk edit i hope that helps